presidents. The president's idea, for instance, for Medicare was to cut it by $700 billion. That's not the right answer. We want to make sure that we preserve and protect Medicare. The president's plan for our, for our budget deficit was to make it worse. And Paul Ryan and I are going to get America to cut our spending and to finally get us to a balanced budget. Now, now, as you know, about four years ago, candidate Obama was speaking in Denver to the Democratic Convention. And he got up there and made a lot of promises. And he did it in front of those Greek columns. I don't think he'll be standing in front of Greek columns at this year's convention. He will want to remind people of Greece, because that's where he's taking our country if we don't get off the road we're on. He said that he would be able to measure progress and measure success by a whole series of his own standards. Number one was being able to create jobs. But I hope he understands that he hasn't done that. 23 million Americans out of work or stop looking for work and can't find the jobs they need to put food on the table for their families. It's unacceptable. It's a moral failure for a nation as successful as ours not to have created these jobs. Mr. President, by your own measure, you failed to deliver the jobs Americans need.